The DBT VS Code extension is now available in public beta, and it brings a hyper-fast, intelligent DBT dev experience right into your editor. It's the only way to enjoy all the power of the new DBT Fusion engine locally, so let's see what it can do. To get started, install the DBT extension from DBT Labs in the VS Code Marketplace. Once you open a DBT project, you'll see the DBT extension label in your status bar to know that it's active and running. So on the left side here, you'll see the file tree for your project. Let's take a look at this fact orders model. While you code, IntelliSense can auto-complete refs and source calls, while things like Hover Insights can actually show you additional context on columns and data types. So what'll happen if I add a column that doesn't actually exist to this order summary CTE? Fusion will flag an error and tell me what the problem is without ever hitting the warehouse, which I think is pretty neat. These powerful little red squiggles that you see here can also highlight things like syntax issues, missing group buys, or just bad function arguments. If you're looking for a quick sanity check, uh, you can hit the table icon to actually preview a model. So we'll do that. Um, you can also look at individual CTEs by clicking preview CTE. The output will show up in this sortable results panel here so you can iterate fast. Under the hood, Fusion parses even large projects dramatically faster than dbt core, which powers the instant feedback and previews that you're seeing. You can also see the lineage and compiled code as you develop. So um, just open the lineage tab to actually see the dependencies at the table level. Uh, the DAG here is interactive, so you can actually use this to quickly navigate between models. You can also check out the lineage for a given column by selecting it from the drop-down menu. As your project grows, it can be helpful to understand um, how specific columns, macros, and refs are actually defined, or you know, where certain columns or models are actually being used throughout your project. Um, it's really easy to do this with one click, and it's perfect to do this before a refactor just to make sure you won't miss any downstream um, you know, impacts of those changes. Speaking of refactors, uh, Fusion makes it really easy to do this. Um, just update it once, preview those changes. So see where that's gonna you know, impact in our project. And then you can approve it and watch as it propagates throughout your project. Um, this is possible for models and will soon be available for columns. So once you're happy with your changes, you can actually click on the DBT icon and select build. That was a pretty quick overview of what's possible with Fusion and the new VS Code extension. So take it for a test drive and let us know what you think.